Hi guys, today I'm gonna to show you how to create this really really cool butterfly effect on any image. You can try with different presets and this is very interesting effect to create in Photoshop. Real quick but sure you need some practice. And stay tuned, I'll be giving you three bonus tips at the end to create it efficiently and to make it look more adorable. So let's get right into it. So let's start the work. Get your hands on this beautiful software Photoshop. You'll be needing an image on which you have to create the overlays and other one is this big black butterfly. Okay, so I advise you to take this butterfly image in PNG format so as to have this background clear. Now the first step, select your first layer, press Command J to make it a copy. I'll rename this layer as liquidity select this liquidity layer go to filter liquify now we are going to distort this image I advise you to keep the size of brush nearly 400 and distort this image as it goes since the hands are going here we'll drag it here <laughs> it kind of looks funny but this is how we gonna create the effect I'll speed up this thing for you. And that's it. It's looking pretty cool. So now we're gonna hit OK. Now we have these two layers, layer 1 and liquidity. Create another layer. Right click on first layer and select create clipping mask and rename this second layer as pixel now create another layer and that's where the fun part begins now get your butterfly on this image now select this magic wand tool single click here it will catch the boundary of butterfly select this rectangular mercury tool and drag this here create another layer and now delete this third layer by dragging it into the dustbin now right click on this butterfly press ok if the default option is black and go to edit menu define brush preset name it as butterfly ok so now we have our butterfly brush ready now we're going to delete this and this layer 4 also select this brush tool go to the toggle panel menu and here we're going to do the settings of this brush keep the size around 40 px and spacing should be greater than 400 percent let's keep it 410 third option is scattering scatter it about 820 percent and it's done now save it call it butterfly brush final hit ok now go to the pixel layer select the brush tool and the best part begins let's start creating the butterflies just simply click and drag in any random pattern you want you can also alter the brush size from here and now the bigger butterfly is on their way and we are pretty much done with part 1 now we want to create the blur effect so select the bottom layer, click on the new layer. Now again select the brush tool, go for the softer one, press I, get the background color. Be careful while selecting the background and just make sure you select the background color which is just next to the part which you want to make blur. Let's select the brush tool again, handle it very carefully. Now here, this color is changing, so we'll again press I select this color again press the brush button and start blurring this takes some time but believe me it's worth it now it's looking good 
it will take some time in the beginning but it's really easy once you practice it carefully you can make it pretty fast now we'll be adding pixel over this area where we have make it blurred go to the pixel layer select your brush to start adding the pixel you can play with size as always Select the pixel layer, go to effects and select crop shadow. The opacity should be around 15 to 20 percent and size about 10 pixels and then hit OK. Now select the liquidity layer, go on creating new layer, make sure the brush is selected and start adding butterflies. Now select the move tool, go to the topmost layer and command plus left click on it which makes sure the butterfly we have just created with the white background are selected now go ahead and delete the topmost layer make sure you are on the liquidity layer now press command G which will duplicate the selected butterfly and now you can add these butterflies also reduce the size of selection by command plus T and start placing it rename this layer as more pixels now right click on it and convert it to smart object now start placing the butterfly wherever you want when you're done you can simply group these you can, you can simply group those layers by selecting all those layers and pressing ctrl g now again create a new layer and name it as color dodge set the blending mode for this layer as color dodge now we'll be adding more butterflies press i to select the color and get into more details now select your brush and start adding butterflies You can add as many butterflies as you want depending on your choice select all these layers and merge it into one layer so here we go now our poster is ready now if you are watching this video till the end it's time for bonus tips now when you will be adding these butterflies make sure these butterflies don't overlap on each other because when it does it looks shabby as you can see we have blurred this hand which has some violet color sweatpants now go to the color dots start adding butterflies here now when you zoom out of this picture you can see this hand is now made with butterflies which makes this picture look realistic same goes with the legs when you zoom out of the picture you can see there are some really big butterflies particularly of violet color now according to color theory it gives the picture the feeling of depth so it will make picture look more interesting and now the best part when you are done adding this picture with butterflies and you have made a single layer out of it press command plus l to enhance the quality of picture which will make it look more and more interesting here we go our butterfly effect is now ready make sure to smash that like button Hit subscribe if you're not already subscribed and look up for the more videos on the right side. Peace out.